Sioux Falls, how are you feeling tonight? Sioux Falls, South Dakota District, this is the debut of Flagship Pro Wrestling, and I asked you a goddamn question. How are you feeling tonight? Did you have fun here tonight, ladies and gentlemen? Yeah. All right. And you heard it. You heard it. This isn't the last time you're going to see Flagship. We're going to be back here in the future. That is a little TBD at the moment. I'm gonna make this short. I'm gonna make this short. I'm gonna make this short and sweet. Whether this is Midwest All Pro or Pirate Pro Wrestling, I'm the man around here, and it's gonna stay that way. That's good, that's good, that's good. We have a little situation out here, you see. Since we took over, belts were turned in by everyone but Jason Strife. He refused to hand over my property. But, but I am fair. I am fair. So I guess I'll just have to take it myself. You have been a cancer on all of us for too long. I didn't really mean it. So I think I'm going to challenge you for that Empire Auto Sales title right now. All right, for those of you who have been following, following Midwest All Pro, the Empire Auto Sales Undisputed Championship has one stipulation, and that is that the challenger gets to pick the stipulation of the matchup. So I'm curious to know, Lucky, what's the stipulation of this match? Oh, I've got a good one for you. You see... Jason Strife is the cream of the crop around here. And I've got a good one, you know. He deserves a great match. And I kind of already had a match tonight. I'm a little beat up. And I want your opponent to be at 100%. So my stipulation is I've got someone else to compete for me.
Ladies and gentlemen, the following contest is scheduled for one fall. And it is your main event of the evening. Now the stipulation is as follows. If Mike Bennett is to win the matchup, then Lucky Lund will be crowned the Empire Auto Sales Undisputed Champion! <laughs> Introducing first, weighing in at 192 pounds from Council Bluffs, Iowa, he is the current reigning and defending Empire Auto Sales Undisputed Champion, Wrestle Daddy. Jason Strife! <laughs> and introducing his opponent from Boston, Massachusetts, weighing in at 210 pounds, Please join me in welcoming the real Mike Bennett! A treat for our first main event here at Midwest, or I'm sorry, at Flagship Pro. Oh, Charlie. Treat, the treat. Empire Auto Sales Undisputed Championship is on the line. And you can say treat, we are in for an unbelievable match because we have two great wrestlers. But this is a travesty, this, this is, is a joke. And I'm joined this by the subsequent ch challenger here with Lucky Lun. That, what a genius maneuver! Genius putting in genius Mike Bennett. This work, is work smarter, not harder, Charlie. This I mean, is single-handedly. I, I don't know why nobody else has thought of this. A single-handedly, the most embarrassing thing to ever happen to this business. I mean, if this is to be the final Empire Auto Sales it's, Undisputed Title matchup, it, what a way to go out! If for some reason Mike Bennett can pull off a victory, which we all know he probably won't, because Jason Strife is the man. Hold on, hold on. You should Let's, relinquish that belt. To let's someone who let's deserves talk it. about this here for a second. Mike Bennett, former WWE superstar. On top of that, he's been in the ring with AJ Styles, the Bullet Club. He has been in there with the best this business has ever offered between Japan, Ring of Honor, WWE, and now all over the world. And Mike Bennett is a world-class athlete standing in there with Jason Strife. Yeah, but he's never been in the ring with Jason Strife, and Jason Strife is the 24-hour Iron Man. Seven-hour Iron Man. Yeah, I've heard it both ways. It doesn't matter. Jason Strife is the greatest professional wrestler in the Midwest. Uh, and all that being said here, he's in there with Mike Bennett, who I had the pleasure of meeting earlier, and I am rooting for him on both a professional and personal basis here. You would, Charlie. You always root for failure, and that's exactly what's going to happen tonight when Mike Bennett comes up short against Jason Strike. It just came up. <laughs> All right, back to the ring here, ladies and gentlemen. Jason Strike rolls to the outside. Mike Bennett turns him around here. Here he oh. comes. Big oh. shot. Come on, Charlie. This is not fair. This is not right. Jason's just trying to get some, get some breath on the outside. Oh, Mike Bennett throwing Jason Strife into the barricade. What a shot. Everyone talks about the professionalism. All I see is dumpster style indie wrestling from Mike Bennett right now because he's beating up Jason Strife and he's not competing like a man. If, if this is dumpster style indie wrestling, then call me a dumpster style commit commentator. I don't mind. And out to the outside into the crowd. Jason Strife. None of this is fair, Charlie. None of this is fair. This should be happening in the middle of the ring, but this coward is doing it all on the outside. All right, Mike Bennett in control of the matchup. Jason Strife thrown back over the barricade. 
Oh, poor Jason Strife. He's a fighting champion, Charlie. Thrown into the other side. Mike Bennett in control. I look at referee Ryan. He doesn't know what to do at this point. Oof, big chop for Mike Bennett. Bennett. Like I said, one of, the, one of my favorite people I've met so far in this industry. Woo! Boot! This is oh. despicable, Charlie. This is unfair. The fact that the crowd is behind this just says that the type of people that are here. All the way from Boston, Mass. Mike Bennett throwing that boot and into the barricade on the other side. Classic Mass hole, Charlie. And here we go. Bennett having a little fun with this crowd. Jason Stripe wanted to have a professional wrestling match, not a street fight. This isn't fair. Oh, again. Did you see that boot? Yeah, I, I want to see one more. I want to see one more. Personally, I want to see one more. Wow, Charlie. Wow, we know where your allegiance lies. I, there's no allegiance. I just don't like Jason Strife. Not personally, not professionally. Again, I, don't, I don't care for the man. It's because you don't like success, Charlie. That's why you're rooting for somebody like Mike Bennett. I don't, I, don't, short tonight. I, don't, I choose to not succeed under Jason Strife, but Mike Bennett is somebody that I would love to learn from. Here we go. How is referee Ryan allowing this? Going all the way around. And Bennett. Oh, oh. European uppercut from Jason Strife. Bravo, Jason Strife, scouting that out. out. Mike Bennett playing to the crowd a little too much, Charlie. Wow. Did you see the shot from Jason Strife? I mean, that European uppercut. I I, I got to give Strife some credit here, though. Uh, Strife, he's, he's, all the accolades he's had, not just in the Midwest, but worldwide. We've seen him on AEW Dark against, up against Powerhouse Hobbs. Had a great showing in that matchup as well. He got well. screwed. Absolute screwed, right, but look at this. Strife, ooh! Tries to get Bennett back into the ring. Not enough to get him up. Bouncing off the ropes, coming back. Forearm straight to the jaw. Right, Bennett now in control on the outside. Gets striped, draped on that, that bottom rope. Discus forearm to the base of the skull. All right, we are back into the, into the ring. Finally back where the match belongs. Here comes Bennett, ooh! And a short drop kick. Jason strikes in a bad and way. Bottom rope. Mike Bennett is fired up, and so is this crowd the here district. at the district. The district loves the real Mike Bennett. All right, Bennett rolls to the outside. He wants Strike back into the ring. If Bennett wins this matchup, then Lucky Lund gets to take back the Empire Auto Sales Undisputed Championship. Oh no. Despicable, despicable rule. A any man who's proud to win a championship can't win himself. Well, and just... the whole, the whole point of that is that we wanted to, fr we wanted to start clean with Flagship Pro. All right, here, tries for that waistline, rolls him up, rolls back. Bennett gets hit with an elbow. Jason Strife on fire. Drapes him over, guillotine across the top row. Charlie, how dare you not give that leapfrog more credit? Jason Strife just jumped over a grown man in Mike Bennett and you just sat there in silence. That was amazing. I didn't sit there in silence. I called the action as, as I could. Absolute amazing. Thank you, Jason Strife, for that performance you just gave us. In control, and Mike Bennett now realizes yeah. the real situation is in. Oh, did you hear that chop? The pec muscle rolling into the shoulder of Jason Strife. Jason Strife is so in such good shape that hurt Mike Bennett more than it hurt Mr. Strife. All right, Jason Strife now draping his leg over that second rope, trying to choke the life out of Mike Bennett. He's only got to the count of five. Charlie, let's take a look around the ring here. Notice, notice one thing different tonight. Jason Strife's alone. He doesn't have his NWO cohorts out there with him. He's by himself. That's how confident very he was different, that he was very different here. indeed. Also, I wanted to point out one thing, and I don't mean to cut you off, but that trying for the those rope breaks there, Mike Bennett is very experienced in pure wrestling over at Ring of Honor. I think Jason Strike had to have had put that into his game plan. He knows when to break that. Absolutely, Charlie. You talk about pure wrestling. Jason Strife is it. He embodies everything you want from a pure professional wrestler. Yeah, but I, want, I do want to go back to your point here. Jason Strife, for the first time in years, is standing alone. And 
here for the debut of Flagship Pro Wrestling. That's the confidence. He knew he was going to come in for the first show of Flagship Pro Wrestling as the Empire Ops Sales Champion. He's going to leave as the Empire Ops Sales oh, Champion. Indeed. Oh, European uppercut from Jason Strape. Jason Strape, waist lock. Oof, atomic drop. Oh, Uber Goody. Snapmare, he's going from one offensive maneuver to the other into a hold right into that chin lock. And look how he wrapped that arm underneath his leg. It's more he than did. just a normal chin lock, Charlie. This is, this is total control. Yep. Mike Bennett is going to have a hard time breaking or getting up out of this. And what Stripe is trying to do, and he he's, he's competing with the strength of Mike Bennett here. He's trying to rip the head one way, the arm the other way. Really work on, on that collarbone, right on that that pec muscle. That's why you're one of the best in the biz, Charlie, exactly. Mike Bennett has the power over Jason Strife. Oh, another chop from Mike Bennett, and another one cut off from Jason Strife. Toe right to the belly button. And you can tell Strife's getting, he's frustrated with these games that are playing, he's annoyed. Ooh, discus forearm from Mike Bennett. Turns he's him around, point of the elbow, met, met the nose of Jason Strife. Stripe hits him with an elbow of his own. I'm impressed. I thought Jason Stripe was out on his feet. And oh, did you see Jason Stripe with that break? That would have made Technical Jerry Lynn perfection. proud. And I just can't believe Lucky Lun is sitting here with this smirk on his face. He's actually proud of what he's doing. Oh, hold on. Springboard into a moonsault, but it's cut off from Mike Bennett. Mike Bennett got the knees up. Jason Strife you know, throwing everything. everything out. He knows the level of this match. He knows how important it is to walk out of here at the maiden voyage of Flagship Pro Wrestling as your Empire Auto Sales on the Street Champion. You know, I, I know we had some height limitations over at Big Bar. It's been a long time since I've seen Jason Strife do a moonsault from the second rope. It's but here at the district, we're throwing everything to the wolves. Jason Strife, Mike Bennett, on their knees fighting for the Empire Auto Sales Undisputed Championship here at the district. And I just want to know how somebody as trashy as Lucky Lun got a class act like Mike Bennett to fight on his behalf. Money. That's what it was. Money. I mean, the, well, we all know where he's getting it from from the sellout tag team partner. And it, wherever you're getting it. I mean, I love Harris Burgers. So, yeah, I, we know, buddy. Yeah. Oh, hold. Getting a little bit up. Another chop right to the peck. Stephanie losing here, Charlie. He tried to cave in the sternum of Jason Strife. Oh, and Bennett, Irish whip into the corner. Back into that chop. Another one. Oh, Andrews how much with can number one two. man take? Hits him. Big exploder suplex from Mike Bennett. That was almost an exploder brain buster, Charlie. Lands right on the shoulders of Jason Strife. Jason Strife is in trouble. Yeah, you would, you would enjoy watching everything you're not capable of. Mike Bennett feeling the energy. His first time here in Sioux Falls. Ducks a clothesline, Bennett with a big super kick. Wraps him around, throws him, Lair, big forearm, right to the temple. He's going for a cover, one, two, and he's got, no. For Not a enough second to there. take out Jason Strife. I thought we had an upset, Charlie. I legit thought we were gonna see an upset. That ripcord into the forearm, that's enough to throw any man off their game, but it should be enough to take out just about any man Jason in professional Stripes. wrestling. Jason Stripes, not any man, Charlie. He is the wrestle daddy, and he is our Empire Rival Sales Undisputed Champion. And Jason Stripes, I mean, he's, he's on some, I think he's on borrowed time in this matchup, I, but Bennett, oh, did, did you see that knee lift? Borrow time. He was scouting it out and waiting for the precise moment to strike. That was one hell of a strike. Oh, he's trying for a German suplex. He likes to use that and keep a hold of it with a bridge. And it tries to that ripcord again. And big takeover from Jason Strife. I think we've got him. He's got him covered. Two and no. Mike Bennett. Two. The Empire Auto Sales. 
from Mike Bennett. Oh no, this does not look good Mike for Jason Bennett Strike. Mike Bennett is mounting it up. Pitch, pisk his forearm. And he's got to cover up two and no. Yes. Only two. Oh. Thank you, we still have a champion to be proud of. What is it going to take for Mike Bennett to end this match? A little bit more momentum. Mike Bennett gets him into a fireman's carry position. What's he setting him up for here? Oh, and Jason Strike break the ice. He's got to cover two and no, no, Mike Bennett kicked out. I think he had a handful of tights. That was the worst officiating I've ever seen. Spear. Strike and a spear from Mike Bennett. Bennett. Sets him up, and a pile driver! He's got him, one, two, three! What a main event, Charlie, and what a horrible outcome! Ladies and gentlemen, the winner of your main event, the real Mike Bennett! Before you guys leave, I'm gonna leave the, the ring to the man who made this all possible right here. But before you guys go, I make it this a point after every match, after every show, because I sincerely mean it from the bottom of my heart. The world's crazy right now. Shit's hitting the fan, part of my language. But I'll tell you what, it means a hell of a lot to me that you guys come out here and spend your hard-earned money to come see us bust our ass in this ring. I've been around, I've been around a hard-working family my whole life. My wife's family is hard-working. But South Dakota, you bring another definition to working your ass off. And I appreciate that from the bottom of my heart. And not only that, but that guy I just wrestled, there's no reason he shouldn't have traveled all around the world by now and been seen on national television. That guy right there in the back is the real deal, and it's a travesty that he hasn't been on television. And that's all I'm gonna say. So thank you, my man. Thank you for bringing me in. You run a hell of a show. The microphone is yours, my friend. Thank you, sir. Thank you, thank you buddy. Thank you. Mike. Bennett! Sold everything but they sold. Straight off the curb. Real rich as you nerds. Address the woman make it sound. I don't do this for nothing. No. I sincerely hope all of you had a great time tonight.